Hi everyone, welcome to Water Tanks with Stewie JP. I'm Stewie, you're not either any of these blokes, this is Ravi. Ravi, the McShouty guy, changes his name every now and then. Ravi from Erie Clan, he's just got himself a, uh, a reward tank. I'm recording this the day after the campaign ended and uh, he'll be pretty happy with that result. Ravi's running around in the Chimera. This is a two-up Tuesday, double shot of Ace Tanker action featuring the Chimera, the Chimera, the Tier 8 premium British uh, medium tank. It's the one with the big gun. This is the second lot, of, this is the second reward tank from the second set of um, personal missions, which you can find in your garage, where it says campaign up there towards the top. Now, this is a, you're getting look, looking at that spec, and this gun is absolutely fabulous. This, this, this tank is all about the gun. Have a look at the gun. It's a 127 millimeter gun, 440 alpha damage, 218 penetration with standard ammunition, which is AP, 252 with APCR. And uh, Ravi, is he on a mission in this one? Talking about, he wants to get a ram kill. For a tank that's higher, he won't get that mission in this game because he's top tier. And he wants to do he wants to do some damage as well. Six and a half thousand. I don't know if he's gonna get six and a half thousand. We'll see. We'll see how he goes. We'll see how he goes in this game. Two zips to score though. We're on Fisherman's Base. Top tier, there's tier sevens and tier eights in this battle. And there's gonna be two uh, two replays featuring Ravi and the Chimera in today's in today's two up Tuesday video. Looking looking in the in the um, Central northwestern part of the map, I guess you could say. Looking for looking for more opportunities. That Ude is 14-5. 14-5 is um, has been shot more than once, I think. And, uh, yeah, and the other Leo has been hit as well for another 415 hit points. 1227 damage done already. We're only two minutes into this game. 1227 damage done. 582 assisted damage. And 360 damage blocked by Armour. He's already he's blocked a shot from that from that Ude. And there's a, the T29 blocks a shot. And uh, he won't be too happy about it. Well, gee, that should have went through. It looked like it was hitting the side of the hull, but uh, but that T29, the Tier 7 American heavy tank, behind the buildings now as uh, Ravi gets ready to rock and roll, get ready to shoot some more tanks. Now, I reckon this is a pretty good-looking tank. This is something I'm going to be working towards myself with the personal missions for the Chimera. I'm... Um I don't know. We've we've finished some of them, but we haven't. But we've still got a little bit of a way to go in certain um, in certain uh, different categories of tanks. Of course, the second lot of personal missions is it's, it goes by nation or groups of nations rather than like the first lot of personal missions were. were you could do it in any any light tank, heavy tank, medium tank. You know what I mean? Every every different tank category. As he bounces the T29 again, he won't be too happy about that. That's that's 800 hit points of damage that's gone begging. Not only for the for the score in the ga in the game, but also for this mission to do six and a half k. And uh, without giving too much away, he doesn't get this mission in this game, but he's still having an absolute ripper. Shoots a Leo again, takes a Leo down to 234 hit points, which is a one shot for Ravi and for quite a few of the other tanks on uh, on Ravi's team. Looking at the mini map, they've got a pretty good presence. They're only up by two tanks, but they've got the map covered. There's plenty. There's a good amount of tanks. In the middle, that T29 made of unappetitive. He finally gets a shot into the T29. Doesn't even need to aim. Now this is a British medium tank. It plays a little. Looks a little bit like a, uh, a charioteer. And he'll be licking his lips, looking at that Leo, saying, "Well, you beauty, you're gonna poke, mate. I'm gonna shoot you." That's his first kill of this game. 2,341 hit points of damage done. A bit blocked. A little bit of assisted. Waits for that gun to reload. 2,341. That's a. When you think that um, the score's only three zip, that's not a bad amount of damage. As he shoots the side of the T29. Looks like the tracks took that, but uh, Ravi didn't take any more damage. Blocked that shot for 320 more damage blocked by armor. It tells me that, that maybe maybe the maybe the armor in the Chimera isn't too bad at all. This will be a nice shot. Into the side of the T54 Mod 1. Takes him down to 516 hit points. 4-1 the score. 2,761 hit points of damage done. He's getting... He's, he's doing all right. He's doing well. He's having a good time. And now that that Leo, as well as the... Uh, the Udes is no longer in the in the middle of the map. Ravi can move up forwards, use this broken building as a little bit of cover. Shoots the side of the Oni. Looks like the Oni just shot back in Ravi's general direction, but he was miles away, which tells me that he's that he's quite possibly um, quite possibly no longer spotted. The Oni shoots with HG for 85 hit points. He loses his driver, but a quick tap of the 5K he fixes the driver again. He wants more damage into that Oni. Doesn't get it because the uh, the friendly Oni picks up the kill on the Japanese Tier 7 Heavy Tank. And that brings the score up to 8-1. 3,177 hit points of damage done so far. 680 damage blocked. A bit of assisted damage as well. Sticking with the standard rounds. Looking down there. Looking towards where the T29 was last spotted. T29. Will he or won't he be... Um, in the same position. He is in a different position. Ravi sees him, shoots him, gets him for 423. The VK3002 confirms the kill. That brings the score back to 9-2. One kill to Ravi. 3,600 hit points of damage done exactly. Driving up now towards the in the 
in the middle part of this. Oh, look at this. will be a beautiful shot. Oh, I just had a feeling that that one was going to go into the dirt, but he hits the side of the Saint Emile, the tier 7. Zero armor, uh, tier 7 um, German tank destroyer. And uh, that brings his damage up to over 4,000 hit points. There, yeah, looking, looking again. He goes looking like the SU. The SU will be a pretty good target. Shoots him and kills him for his second kill. And that just leaves a T28 up there in that corner. Looking very, very nervous indeed. That's the last enemy take. Aim, Ravi. Aim, aim, aim. Get another shot in. Get another shot in. Aim. He shoots it. Gets him for 457. And, um, well, is he going to get another shot? It looks like he's... It looks like he's, the T28 is blocking a fair bit, showing Ravi is his rear. Ravi might get another shot in here. Wait, hold that left mouse key down. Gets him, blows his head off with the Amarak shot for the final kill of the game. Brings his damage to over 5,000 hit points. And not only is that a victory, not only is that a victory, but it's an ace tanker mastery badge. You've seen it here before, folks. An ace tag, a mastery badge for Ravi the McShouty guy. Not sure what the story is behind the McShouty guy tag, but um, but I'm sure I'm sure it's a funny um, a funny story. Ravi, community contributor as well. He does Twitch and YouTube. His links are going to be down below, along with all the other stuff that I've got down there. Check him out. Very good player. Nice bloke as well. And he was on even at Oz Armor Fest. He goes to some of the uh, the wargaming piss ups as well, and it, they're all well worth. A visit anyway that game ace tanker mastery badge spot a medal for um doing over a thousand hit points of assisted damage bruiser medal demolition for blowing the head off one of those tanks it was a t28 the last kill of the game fire for effect he got 27 bonds confederate and high caliber for um doing more damage than anybody else 5030 hit points of damage three kills 1378 base experience he fired 18 shots 17 hit nothing wrong with that accuracy 13 penetrated there was a couple that didn't pen the uh the T29, and there must have been a, one or two more. A little bit sniped, got some blocked, got nearly 1,200 assisted damage. Even made some good coin, even paying full price for the uh, for the coffee, or the pudding and tea, whatever you call it. Even paying full price for the pudding and tea, you still made uh, 36,500 credits. That's after tax with a premium account in that six-minute game. As we move on to our second replay, it's Ravi again, and again is in the Chimera, the second reward tank in the second lot of personal missions. This time he's not top tier, this time there's some tier 9s. Four tier 9s on each team. The T49, Derp Cat on the AMX 1390, the Udez 16 and the Emil 2 on the enemy team on Ravi. Ravi Steve's also got an Emil 2. Uh, a GSOR, Udez 16 and a uh, IS-3 version 2, the double shooting, uh, the double penetration uh, Russian heavy tank. Spots Udez 15, gets some assisted damage, hides behind this rock. Uh, he knows that there's going to be. He knows there's going to be people sniping from up there. Is he on the same kind of mission? He's on the same kind of mission to do 6,500 hit points of damage. He's also on a mission to get a ram kill. Let's see if he can do that. The ram kill has to be a higher tier. We mentioned that in the last uh, in the last um, in the last replay. Shoots and sets on fire. The Udes 14.5. He gets it. He gets the fire put out uh, quickly, but he gets. Um, he got some damage. He got an extra 200 hit points of damage for that um, for that uh, for that fire. Zero zero the score now. Playing on steps. Ravi the McShouty guy from Eric Land shoots and kills the Udez 14-5. Brings the score up to one zip. Gets spotted. Maybe by the Udez 16 or maybe by the Emil 2. Udez 16 looks like a likely target for a very uh, cheeky kill. The T44 agrees and kills him in that little bowl. The T44 down to 23 hit points. You can see him there. The IS3 version 2. Getting very uh, cheeky indeed. Ravi uh, sees an opportunity to shoot the Emil in the lower plate. Takes it. Still gets spotted. So he can, the, the time it takes for the gun to reload is probably enough time for him to go unspotted. And then uh, and then poke out again using the bushes as uh, as a little bit of, bit of cover. 1565 hit points of damage done so far. Poking out. Looking at the Emil. The Emil only showing the top of his turret. Not sure. I'm not sure if 218 millimeters of penetration in the AP rounds are going to... Uh, they're going to be able to uh, to cut the mustard in that case. So he crosses over, gets spotted on the way. There's a T44-100 printed Jetstar. I always used to think that guy's name was Jetstar. But um, <laughs> that's okay. Two zips to score on steps. We're on a mission. We're on a mission for the ram kill. We're also on the mission for the 6500. I don't think he's going to get the 6500 in this game. But this is the kind of lineup where you might be able to get the ram kill mission. The ram kill mission you've got to do... You've got to do um, Destroy a vehicle that's one tier higher. And there's there's three. There's three T9 tanks left on the enemy team. The T34-3 shoots Ravi with high explosive ammunition for 112 hit points. That's not the way to do it, man. That is not the way to do it. I'm not sure if he was... Maybe maybe he was trying to do a, a, a mission to kill crew members or something. Somebody else shot him with HE in the last battle as well. 
Um, his gun gets damages. He fixes his gun. That's no problem. 3-1 the score. Just kicking back here on this little undulation. Looking at the five remaining tanks that were last spotted over here in the middle. The T-44, the T-49, the Emil 2, the T-28, and the T-44-100. All last spotted in this area. There's a T-44-100 on 1,001 hit points. So Ravi looks like he's hoping to kill the T-44 to make that scoreboard look even better. He does. He blocks the shot for 250 hit points. At least he was firing normal bullets, right? 4 won the score. Two of those kills belong to Ravi. Ravi the McShouty guy from Erie Clan. Community contributor. Um, Twitch live streamer. YouTube. Links down below. Check him out. He knows what he's doing. This is the Chimera. Two up Tuesday. Ace tanker. Um, the second reward tank for the second lot of personal missions. If that makes sense. 4-2 um, the score. He's just looking around. Just takes a look around. Thinking, right here, I've got 1,288 hit points left in the tank. Done 2844 damage already. 5 twos the score. Taking his taking his time. The IS-3 version 2 rolling up there towards where the T-49 was last spotted. Will the T-49 get lit? Ravi gets spotted, but he's already committed. He's already rolled over the little hill. The Emil 2 gets killed. The T-44-100 and the T-49 both last seen over there. There's that, that Udez looks dangerously low hit points. There's the, there's the T-44-100. Turns around and sees there's a T-49 back there. Gets taken out by the T-4. That T-44 is having a ripper. He's bearing in mind he was on um, very low hit points for um, very very low hit points very early. He was on about 40 health. Uh, the T-44-100 shoots Ravi, rams him. Ravi says, if you don't mind, I'll just take the kill. That's his third kill of this game. 3,382 damage done. Three kills. 9 for the score. Looks towards the IS-3. The IS-3 over there. Looks like the, his, his friends have got the IS-3 covered. And that just leaves the AMX 1390 in the central part of the map. As well as those heavies down there in the southwest. Shoots and misses the AMX 1390. He's got to, he's got to start chasing the Tier 9 French light tank. The score's 10-5. There's four enemy tanks remaining. The 1390, which is a Tier 9. Remember that mission? Looks like Ravi's remembered that mission. He's making a beeline for the Tier 9 auto-loading French light tank. The one that leads to the, the 105. Now, this used to be a Tier 8 tank, I think. Was it Tier 8? Yeah, it was. And it was pretty uh, It was pretty groovy indeed. That shot misses as well. It hits the dirt. Probably needs to get a little bit closer to the AMX 1390. Try and peg him into a corner, maybe. I'm not sure. Three kills. 3,384 3, hit points of damage done. Ravi Thane. Well, if he's going to run away, I want to go farm some damage on these heavy tanks. Why the hell not? Blocks the Patriot, the T26E5, for 240 hit points. Damage blocked by armor. Rolling, going forward, doesn't seem to be going very fast. He's slowed right down, hoping to shoot on the move. The, the SM, the Samur SM, gets the kill on the batch at 12T. Ravi shoots, the T26E5 blocks the return shot again. And um, i tell you what, the, the, um, the, the armor on this is really holding up. I've never, I've never driven one of these bad boys. I haven't got it yet. Um, but the armor really holding up in both of these games. Shoots, BVK. The Udez 14.5 confirms that kill, and that just leaves the Samua and the AMX 3090, the two French auto-loading tanks. The Samua Tier 8 Premium, which is a tank that I really enjoy playing. And, uh, and the AMX 3090, which has just killed the T-44. Um, it just killed the T-44. Uh, who was capping? 12-7 the score now. Ravi the McShouty guy on three kills. 4,241 damage done. The Samua just killed the Udez and he might be reloading. He might be reloading, not too sure. Doesn't matter because um, the Samua kills the Udez. The IS-3 version 2 kills the Samua. Ravi gets a shot in there as well, bringing his damage up to nearly 5,000 hit points. And that just leaves the AMX 1390. Remember that mission? Let's see if we can do it. Destroy an enemy vehicle that's one tier higher by ramming. Which I think is also the... Um, Kamikaze medal. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we can find him. We'll quicken it up just a little bit. There, here he is. He's on 908 hit points. He, plenty of his friends are, are shooting him. He's down to 298. Is he going to shoot him? He shoots him. And he bounces. He bounces the 1390. Turns and carves into it. Gets the ram kill for the mission. And mission complete. Pops up to the top of the thing and also to win and survive which is done survived on 557 hit points that's not a bad game ravi not a bad game at all not only was it a win but it was also the ace tanker mastery badge and the mission the kamikaze mission ace tanker mastery badge hand of god bruiser duelist fighter fire for effect you got a bond you got a high caliber the kamikaze is an absolute ripper and um that was the mission to get a kamikaze medal in that game. 5,530 hit points of damage done. Four kills. 1634. Base experience. He fired 15 shots. 12 hit. 11 penned. 
Blocked 1180. It's not bad for a medium, especially when you're bottom tier in that game. And a little bit of assisted damage as well. Not bad coin. Again, 37,500 credits after tax with a premium account in that seven-minute game. Don't forget to check out Ravi on Twitch and YouTube. Links will be down below. And he's also um, also a community contributor and a nice bloke. So uh, check him out on there. Like, subscribe, all that kind of jazz. Thanks, Ravi, for the replays. The Chimera. I'm looking forward. Hopefully, I can get it one day. Maybe that's what I'm going to start focusing on um, in my gameplay. Um, thanks for the replays. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care and see you all next time. Yeah.